Hey, my name's Henry. Uh, and I, I've been holding a secret from all you guys. I don't much uh, like the environment. Ah, uh, the physical video game store. See, it's a great thing to have if you don't want to wait for Amazon to deliver the game to you and you want to kill the environment with plastic. Yeah, I could buy games digitally, but come on. A physical collection looks amazing. So how do I get a physical video game in less than a day with a physical location? I'll go to GameStop. Now, GameStop isn't the only game store, but it's really the only game store. I mean, come on, it's called a GameStop. That's branding, man, like Toys R Us, Best Buy, MalariaCon. I still remember walking into GameStop all the time as a kid. I didn't even have to walk out with a new game. The experience of just being there was enough. And if I did buy a new game, oh boy, that was a really great day, all right? It was always so exciting to walk out of that store with a game. I still remember buying Super Smash Bros. for 3DS. That was a really awesome day. Just walking around the racks of games was always a joy, and seeing all the games that I wanted but couldn't afford made me actually want to save money so that I could buy them. Of course, there was the trade-in system, but I only ever really used it once, even though it was a great option. Also, the ability to buy used games at a cheaper cost was always a nice option. And yeah, they can be a bit pushy with the reward system, which kind of sucks, but I know it's never really the employee's fault, it's just what management tells them to say. But come on, tone it down a little. Their pre-order system is amazing. I've only ever pre-ordered two games from GameStop, Pokemon Let's Go Eevee and Pokemon Shield. And the whole 9pm the night before it releases release? That was always so fun! Imagine, fans of the game, the game you like, all in a line, ready to get the game early. They're some of the most fun I've had at GameStop and some of the best memories to do with gaming. But wait, I hear you say. I thought this was a video about the sad, slow death of GameStop due to the rise of online marketers as a higher competitor to the retail business. And it is, like most retail stores, dying. And you'd be right. Yeah, recently I've noticed something not so great about all game stores, GameStop included. They're dying off. Yeah, maybe two or three years ago it was quicker to travel to GameStop than order a game off Amazon, but with the introduction of two-day free shipping, one-day shipping, same-day delivery, it's now more a hassle to go to the store than buy your games and just wait a few hours. And this kind of saddens me to see such a big part of my childhood dying slowly. But in all honesty, why should I be sad? Now I don't even have to leave my room to buy a video game. But I think I know why I'm so sad. GameStop wasn't just a big part of my childhood. It was such a good place to go and look at games, demo a few, talk to some of the employees about upcoming games or just what game I'm buying. It wasn't just a store, it was a social experience and I'm gonna miss it. Seeing GameStop slowly and sadly die still makes me sad, though. Who knows, maybe a bigger and better company will be able to buy GameStop and, you know, maybe it'll be revived. I spoke too soon.